At 22 years old, Sebastian Bales has already amassed nearly 13 million followers on TikTok. I've had my cheekbones, my nose, I've had an eyebrow lift, I've had lips done. A body of work that includes a lot of work on his body. You're just 22 years old. Why do you need to have all these procedures done? I feel like when I'm on camera all the time, I'm always getting nitpicked by, you know, viewers, haters, people that are always judging you. You feel the need to want to, I guess, make everybody happy. He's not alone. NBC News spoke to 12 social media personalities with audiences ranging from 100,000 to more than 10 million followers. They all feel the pressure to achieve perfection. And so it's kind of a domino effect where one extremely famous person is open about their lip filler and then you see other influencers pick up on those social cues and then go on to replicate the phenomenon for their own following. For 19-year-old influencer Anna, the procedures have ranged from lip filler to more invasive plastic surgery, work that's done for free or with a big discount in exchange for a video on TikTok. It's kind of like a, a little bit of like an ego boost in a way. But experts worry about the impact these posts could have on kids who already have body image issues. This creates the perfect storm, and it makes it so young people may indeed want to get plastic surgery after being exposed to repeated images that say, this may be the solution for you. It's time for these influencers to say, I'm going to be an influencer for good. How worried are you that some young people are getting these procedures done because they're influenced by you? Very worried, which is why I haven't posted a single post about getting work done in over two years. Both Sebastian and Anna say they've now taken a step back from cosmetic procedures. As I got more and more offers, I realized, like, I don't need this. I'm 19. I'm so young. I can live without it. And I feel like my face is forever changed and kind of, like, ruined in a way. And it will never go back to how it was before I got everything done. TikTok says cosmetic procedures cannot be advertised on the platform through official TikTok ads, but those rules don't apply to videos from users. The company told NBC News the goal is transparency and that it requires users to disclose when they develop branded content. And the American Society of Plastic Surgeons says that it has a code of ethics that applies to advertising. They always try to approach things ethically and professionally and have a message of a positive body image, especially for young girls. Peter and Kristen. Honestly, Joe, I feel for that guy, Sebastian, mm. there who says he's on social media and he feels nitpicked and he yeah. wants to try to please everybody for kids watching. The message you try to share with your own kids is it's not about pleasing others. It's about feeling good about yourself. That's the real takeaway. Exactly. I like the influencer who said or the analyst who said you should be an influencer yeah. for good. Hey, thanks for watching our YouTube channel. Find your favorite recipes, celebrity interviews, uplifting stories, shop our favorite deals, and so much more with the Today app. Download it now.